Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West, where I am without a mount. It's I okay. Think. Yep. We'll get you back to base as soon as I catch my breath. <gasps> I thought I was dead for sure. Oh, nom, nom, nom. I'm sleepy, which is good because I've been drinking soda all day. Done. I was annoyingly impatient at your age, too. <laughs> Everything okay? What are you doing out here? Ask my grandmother. I risked leaving guard duty to look for her. She stopped to see the bloom, and now she won't leave. Since when does she care about flowers? They're not just flowers, child. They're scarlet stems with the scent that soothes the nerves. Or so I was told many years ago, by an Utaru seed tracker. An Utaru? Now you're telling stories. If one trespassed here back then, you'd have killed him on sight. I couldn't. Found him picking flowers. Right near here, in Tanakh territory. I was all set to strike him down, but he was singing. Singing? Can't remember the tune now. Just the lilt of his voice. And his name. Nilo. He decided to stay for a day or two. I took guard duty here so I could keep coming back to Aww. him. And he kept delaying his return to plain song. For the flowers, he said. Please don't tell me I'm descended from a Utaro gardener. <laughs> <laughs> Almost. Almost. But the thrill of battle called to me, and he had to return to his people. I've always wondered about the life I missed with him. Whether he misses it too. Would he welcome me in plain song? Or at least accept a scarlet stem? It's a long way to plain song. But I get back there now and then. I could pick some scarlet stems and bring them to Nilo, if I can find him. Please. He was an herbalist there. I know the time has long since passed. But I'd like to know. Well, I'd like him to know. Aw. You know what I mean. Aww. I think I do. Nilo's like, I think. Encouraging an old woman? Why would you do that? Why wouldn't I? Yeah. Yeah, like, what do you mean? Like, what's your problem? Little kid, you know? Like, she looks younger than me. She's probably like 15. Like, I don't know. What do you, what do you want? Like, what do, when kids sometimes try to like flame old people for like getting, for, or people that they see as old, like heaven forbid, being 30 and liking. Think she'll find that new guy? I thought you didn't care. Yeah. I don't. Not. Really? Like, your life doesn't end, you know what I mean? Past 30 or past 40 or 50, like, you have hopes and dreams and things still. A life to live. Old loves. Old, old rivalries, you know, I don't know, just stuff. Like, why, I don't know, your life's not, it just doesn't make sense. Like, sure, sometimes old people can get rambly and you're like, okay. Oh, want to take a moment and admire the view. Okay. And I'm done. But also, yes, it's the it's the whole idea of being like living life fast and young. When you get older, you learn to stop and smell the sm the smell the flowers. Like literally, sometimes enjoy the view. You know, that's something I've tried to incorporate into my life, starting young. You know, younger. It's like not being afraid to stop and. Take a breather and look Breathe around. Languished. Fitting place for Yara and Draka's challenge, I guess. At least it didn't become a bloodbath. It kind of did, but it was very single-handed on my part. I don't know, it's just nice. It's just nice to see people, older people, living their lives. And like in the what is it the Tanakh culture, they're value they're valuable because they're like um, you don't you have to be a very strong warrior to make it that far like make it that long you know. Oh, I think I did this. I think I came down into this one before and I couldn't do anything. Not that I knew of. Falling gently. What was it? I'm not getting out the way I came in. There must be an exit somewhere. I... 
It's just nice to see a wide variety of people having different lives and hopes and dreams and etc. etc. You know. Uh, let me look this up actually. Apparently, it's tied to some sort of main quest thing, so I don't want to. I don't want to go. I don't want to keep digging too far. I'll apparently get to it after talking to Gaia or something at some point. Made it. That was a long climb. So glad they didn't make me do it. Okay, so we're not doing that. I need to find a mount. Okay, let's go grab let's go grab a charger really quick. The chargers weren't super fast, but it's something. And I did double check online, and the claw striders being slow is just uh, just the way they are designed to be. I kind of wonder if it's maybe because they're two-legged instead of four-legged. I think in real life and in combat, they're really freaking fast, so it's kind of not fair why they can't jog. I, we are, I'm two-legged, Aloy's, you know what I mean? Aloy's two-legged, like, why can't, why can't the claw striders go fast? They're also the coolest, so it feels like they, they nerfed them on purpose. Just so people would use other ones. The bristleback hog things are faster, you know? Oh, there's a bunch of them. What? Oh! Oh no, those are just enemy ones. One moment. Got it. I didn't think I would. Let's go, baby. Go, 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 go. I didn't think it would let me grab it since it was alerted. But here we are. Oh my gosh, that thunder jaw just literally dropped down out of the sky. And I need to go sort of past it. Oh, because we, we drove off. We drove off where we were supposed to be. Yeah, the charger is way faster. Oh boy. These guys are fast. No, don't slow down now. Bad time to slow down. I do love the auto drive. Wish I could ride a Fanghorn. Since I am low on resources, it might be best if I go in with stealth and try to stab him in the back, but I don't know. I think that'll get him. It got the other one at one point. by that armor, I think I know who's in charge. Let's see if this Ooh, one's nice. got tags on them, too. Some oh, no. tags oh. I should take them to Duca. Without a leader, the rebels should abandon this place. But I could always deal with them now. Or... Either way, I'm done here. We just hide. Check all the cover around here. This is the area. I'm not gonna run over here. I don't like this. Got it. <laughs> don't be fighting. Don't fight other machines. Don't do it. Made it. I'm out. <laughs> Sweet. We completed that one. Sort of. Ooh, there's a. An unknown rebel camp down south. I don't know why. I'm just. I'm just apparently actively determined. To get these. These tags I keep finding. 
I need to return them to the Tanakh. Who am I supposed to give them to? I don't remember who I'm supposed to give the tags to. Oh, in the, um... The main swamp area. Somewhere at the grove will take Yeah, at the home. grove, at the grove. Look at that thing. What? Oh, is that Las Vegas? I was like, why is that glowing? Is that futuristic stuff? Oh yeah, completed. You know what? I don't actually, I don't want to do that right now. Just gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead and say it. You know what? Let's go to Plain Song. Actually, first, before I keep forgetting. Let's go, let's go here. Drop off the tags to somebody. I don't know who. And then we'll go to Plain Song. See if we can find that guy to give some flowers. It seems simple, but I feel like it's going to be a gut punch of one. Somehow. Well, like, yeah, I don't know, it's a cute story, right? Like, the Tanakh warrior woman, and, like, you know, like, the, the wild Tanakh warrior woman, and the, like, what do you want to call him? Like, uh, the, the zen-like seed hunter, you know, the, the flower boy. I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, it's kind of cute. It's kind of a cute little, little story. Balancing each other's out just for a few days, but at the same time, it's just like it's almost just super nice because of that, you know. <laughs> okay, so it is that one. It is the this one. What can I do for you, Aloy? Got some more tags for you. I'm never yeah. happy to get them, the next time but hopefully leave, they'll comfort the squad mates and families of our lost soldiers. You know, kind of this is for you. As always, the tribe values wrong. your efforts. You doubted the chief's right. word. More tags? I'll see well, what I got. I guess I should go. Safe travel. Maybe it's just in batches, essentially. Oh, okay, okay. She got me. She gave me some ah, stuff. Aloy, welcome. Apparently this woman, if you get medals, she'll give you the really sweet trapper armor. Sorry. Oh. I don't actually have any tags right now. No problem. Let me know when you find some. I like her face paint. I need to get going. Of course. Good luck. I thought since it was still white, it was like, oh yeah, here's some more tags. And I was like, what? Oh, time to go back to plain song. You. We've kind of been in the area recently, but it's been our first time going back to play the song itself. I wonder if we'll find his little seed pouch instead, like an area where they've planted his seed pouch and we can lay the flowers there, maybe. Or maybe he's alive and I'm just being tragic for no reason. I don't know, I, just, I like these, I'm, I'm a big fan of warrior woman and like mage man kind of a thing. Like I'm a big fan of like beefy warrior lady. And like, I don't know, like I, I I don't know how do you say, like the like dichotomy I guess the juxtaposition is probably a better word, um, and especially like kind of it's kind of like the flip on the the stereotypical roles, but I just I should look for the herbalist. I like it. I'd still be Nilo. I like it. <laughs> Given the scarlet stumps. I think it's 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 interesting. It's a nice little twist. I don't usually talk to the herbalist. Still up or what? I think plain song is probably my favorite design. May the land bloom in your skin. You look you look maybe too young. My remedies can cure. Yeah, you're too young. Outlander? What can I do for Maybe. You? You're the herbalist here, right? Are you Nilo? No. Nilo was before my time. I think he went up north a while back to river him. Why? Do you need a special solve? No. What was that teeth thing he did? Does, in a way. Thanks. I'll try river him. There's a grove there, a, a memorial, a beautiful greenery. If he's there, I, I bet he'll be tending it. Thanks again. 
glad I could help. His teeth thing, I don't like... I hope you find what you're looking for in River Him. He talks with his upper lip, and so you see his, like, upper teeth. They're not his lower teeth. It's, it's disconcerting. Yeah, I think I think I definitely have to say, whoever got to design Plain Song, kudos to you. I mean, all of them are cool, but whoever got to work on Plain Song just, I think, had a heck of a time. It's beautiful. Very intricate, too. Oh, I love it. I love it. Very much. What is, what is this? Low and then. Reunited after the old growth. What? Who? Oh! There she is. The hunter that saved my sorry rump. I'm glad she did. I shouldn't have left you out there. Enough of that. If you hadn't run, you'd be dead. And no use to anyone. He's right. That cost rider was a killer. Thank you, Outlander. You saved us both. I wouldn't have been able to live with the guilt. What's next, then? Thunderjaw? A Stormbird? Uh -huh. More like a nap. Yeah. Sleep Mood. Well. You deserve it. Mood. Sometimes on my nomad excursions, people are like, where are you going next? I'm like, my tent. And I'm going to sleep there for three days. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I'm tired. But I love it, you know? Like, the, don't get me wrong. As always, there's ups and downs. There are days where I'm like, man, I wish I could do something fun, but I feel like I don't have, like, the gas money or something, you know, to, like, drive around. And I'll just sit here in the desert, which I also enjoy. So, like, you know, it's like, <laughs> I can't say it's too bad. <laughs> you yeah, know, but I guess it, it's a bummer if I want to be out and doing stuff, but I can always just kind of walk around wherever I'm at, you know? <laughs> just put a, put a GPS point on my camp and take off. <laughs> you want to improve your next hunt. I should look Let's for Nero. Give him the Scarlet Stones. Was this the one... Where what's his bucket was? The guy who gave us the bow. We like helped. I think this is yeah. I think this is the place where we helped defend. It does have a very nice memorial grove because I I remember now because he said like that we have a and his daughter's like seeds were buried there. No. Did she say no? <gasps> no, I knew it. I knew he was gonna be dead. Uh, hi there. Nora, here. You're a long way from home. I suppose I am. I'm looking for an herbalist named Nilo. I think I heard you say his name. You've come to the right place. His seeds were buried here, where he tended the blooms of others. Including my mother's. I'm his daughter, Gia. <gasps> oh, ah! Oh! How long has he been gone? Some five years now. He put a lot of love into this grove. Almost as much as he gave me. That's why I could never abandon River Him. I'd like to leave some flowers, if I may, from an old friend of his. <laughs> Scarlet stems. They're rare in these parts, but they were his favorite. I never knew why. He planted them whenever he could, but never picked them. Prefer to just watch them bloom. Sounds about right. So he was a good man who led a full life? He was. And he did. Ugh. I don't know who this old friend gonna is. gonna make me cry. <laughs> but if my father liked them, they must be a good soul. It's good to be remembered for the good deeds that you've left behind. And to be remembered by those who may not even know your face, but know the legacy you left behind. I have a good friend recently who is either gone or very nearly. And he had left a good legacy behind in this little community on YouTube and on Twitch. I only know him via the internet, but he was a good friend and I just hope he's happy and comfortable. Wherever he is. Clouds are spent. Rain's done.
Look, the Outlander's back. I can still see well enough, girl. <laughs> Is my long vigil over? You have word from my grandmother's gardener? Yes and no. I laid the scarlet stems at his grave. His favorite flower, according to his daughter. Always loved to watch them bloom. He's gone. But he did think of me over the years. That'll have to be enough. Really? That's it? Are you sure you got the right guard? Herbalist? Huh. Seemed like you thought it was a fool's errand. Well, it's just that it meant something to you. It could have been a whole other life. Could have been. But this life hasn't turned out so bad. I even have a granddaughter who cares enough to come looking for me out in the wilds. And I've still got scarlet stems to remind me of Nilo. Sounds like your grandmother's got it all figured out. Maybe she does. Just... Tell me the next time you want to come out here, okay? Instead of disappearing? Maybe I will. <laughs> here, Outlander. Take this. For helping an old woman to remember she was once young. I'll never look at these flowers the same way again. I'm glad you'll look at them at all. So many of these side quests seem to just hit me right <laughs> at the emotional moment when they would have the most impact. <laughs> what? <laughs> I can't pick up on the daughters, but I can hear the grandmas. But, no. For my friend. Not to be too sappy. I may not have known his real name. Or his face, but I knew him by his actions. And I guess you could say, like, <laughs> to be cheesy, the blooms that he left behind. He will be remembered very fondly, so. Rest well, Stone Smith. <laughs> I realize you didn't play this game or anything, but he was a he was a Bioware fan through and through, so. I'll be playing Dragon Age 4 with him in mind, but. This seemed too poetically convenient, I guess. So, anyway. Thank you all so much for joining me. I am going to call this one here. Sorry, it's on a little bit of a downer. But, you know, it's also, I don't know, it's not so much of a downer as a, as a farewell. So, in some ways. Wow, these quests are... Ugh. <laughs> so thank you all again for watching I appreciate it really quick I want to say thank you to my patrons to all my patrons uh, but to especially Reese Galito my sapling tier patron thank you so much for your continued support I appreciate it a lot uh, and an extra special shout out to Christopher my tree tier patron who is the super bestest and I hope you're enjoying the videos and to all my patrons I am sorry that I, I will just continue to apologize and never change my ways maybe but <laughs> I am sorry I haven't posted a Patreon update in a while um, life's going well, ups and downs as always, but, <laughs> um, thank you all again for watching to everybody, I appreciate it, and I hope to see you all in the next one.